All right, so this is the new project, the new series. What I'm going to do, and this is going to be interesting because I've never done this before, is I am going to be building an electric guitar. Now, this is going to be interesting for a couple of reasons, not the least of which being that I have never actually done this, uh, but also uh, I don't actually have um, very many power tools at all. What you can see here with almost uh, very little uh, exception is pretty much the entirety of the working space that I have. So I don't have band saws or table saws or power planers or jointers or anything like that. Um, so I'm going to be uh, uh, building this guitar by hand by hand. Uh, you know, we're talking planes and spoke shapes here, people. The best saw I got is, uh, is this. It's, um, well, it's German. Yeah, basically I'm going to be cutting out the entire body of a guitar with one of these. <laughs> so, it's going to take a while. But I have my plans here, and uh, I did this using the PDF to MDF uh, tutorial out of Inkscape. I forget what site it's on, but if you Google PDF to MDF, you're going to, you're going to find it. Uh, so this is the uh, the basic shape that I want. But I did do this on my own, modeled after my own two ESP Explorer style guitars, and just kind of changing the shape based off of how I kind of wanted them to be. And found out a little bit later after the fact that I had inadvertently uh, basically reinvented the Jackson Kelly. But uh, I did this before I, I looked at the Kelly, and that's my story and I'm sticking to it. That's the body shape that I'm going to use, and it's going to be made out of uh, this bad boy right here which is a big piece of mahogany. But mahogany is not terrifyingly interesting. So I do have this piece of uh, canary wood here, which I thought looked pretty interesting. Uh, this bit over here. So I'm gonna cut this, resaw this in half and book match it, and that'll be the top of the guitar. But I don't know if I have enough of, the, of this canary wood. Um, so I've got a couple of other pieces of like uh, walnut and stuff floating around here that may uh, may come into pinch hit. And there's a, there's a lot of other hardware and stuff that I'm going to have to uh, to order kind of as the build goes on. But I still need to buy the, the bridge and tutors and all that other hardware. But I have this pair of finger burners from Lace Electronics, and these are going to be my uh, pickups. And since this is the first time I'm doing anything like this, I'm attempting to hedge my bets a little bit. So I have a prefabricated uh, guitar neck from Eden Guitars. Um, <laughs> it wasn't stupefyingly expensive. It seems to be okay put together for the you know the body that I'm going to put it on. This headstock ain't going to do it, so I'm going to need to uh, reshape it a little bit just to make it fit the theme a little bit more. But I like the I like the neck. The hard parts have all already been done for me. This is obviously intended to be a replacement neck for uh, some sort of uh, Les Paul style guitar, but I'm going to be putting it on my, uh, my Kelly ripoff. So I don't know how long this is going to take me to do, and I don't know how quickly I'm going to progress with it, but I will be uh, attempting here to kind of log my progress and uh, as the build continues periodically, I will be um, uploading more videos into the series. Hopefully this turns out cool.